Landslides by Cactus Jack. We've had a track by Cactus Jack already, if I recall correctly, and this is another one here in the cup of the day. The 28th of December and this day marks the day where Riolo TM actually games with the bongos in Trackmania. So I have, uh, you know, I have some experience now. So let's see how it's gonna go with experience. Ah, oh, shit. So let me know what position you think I'm gonna get. Whether I'm gonna meet your expectations or not at the end of the, <laughs> at the end of the cup. <laughs> okay, we good, we good. We're actually not bad here. Actually not bad. So far, so good. We have a very technical map here. Oh shit, ice? What the fuck? Oh. Uh, okay. Alright. 49-6-1. That's pretty good. Let's keep going. That's not terrible. Not playing on Bongo TM? Yeah, Bongo TM does not have access to Cup of the Day, sadly. Because it's a free account. <laughs> Okay, no crash this time. So far so good. It's actually a nice map, like the cave theme. I gotta say it's pretty, pretty well made. Gonna take a bit of a higher jump here. This is probably full speed. Okay, now turn to the right. You get a pretty heavy oversteer here from the ice. Okay, Pog, gold medal. Nice, man. That wasn't even terrible. <laughs> that wasn't even... That wasn't even slow at all. Let's go. We are gaming, ladies and gentlemen. Look at me go. <laughs> Just gotta nail down this tight corner. I lose a lot of time here. That is not good. Oh, even got the gear. I mean, with some practice, you can you can learn everything, right? And maybe at some point I'm gonna play Trek Mini Grand League with bongos as well. Dude, look! I actually made the jump as well. Okay, 40.6, I got the author time. I'm freaking 19th with bongos. I mean, <laughs> this is going better than expected, to be honest. <laughs> <laughs> I actually can't believe it, man. This is going a lot better than expected. But don't call it too early, because the knockout is going to be a lot harder. The knockout is going to be a lot harder. So everyone who's like, Hey, uh, Riolo, I started playing Trackmania. I wonder what input device should I play with? Should I play with keyboard or ship? Should I play with controller, maybe? I think the answer is clear. You play with Donkey Kong Bongos. So it's a good bongo map, I have to say. A uh, bit of a slow start here for Riolo TM, but he closes in. What an angle! Okay. No, I jumped. Fuck. Very sad. But mistakes, they happen. You know? Mistakes, they happen, but you can still recuperate. You can still catch. Uh oh. You can still catch up. So, right now, P62. That is much better than uh, what I expected to get at any point of this time attack seeding. We're playing 15 minutes, by the way. 15 minutes of time attack. That's how the cup goes. I'm already getting hand cramps. But the sacrifices have to be, have to be made, you know? If you wanna work on a certain career, you have to make the sacrifices. You wanna learn the guitar, you have to, you know, break your fingernails 8,000 times. You wanna learn, I don't know, uh, bongo gaming, you gotta get the hand cramps. We're pretty good. <laughs> Pingo, what is that emoji? 
What is that? Oh, this is good, this is good, this is good, this is good. Okay, good gear, good gear, good gear. Oh my god, what a juicy drift. Yo! <laughs> I had to lift a bit. We good, we good. Air brake. I got under 40. Yeah? 3983 with bongos. And you know, this part of my of my hand already hurts as fuck. This is already feeling like someone uh, burnt it. Oh, fuck, man. Five, six minutes. And I'm already done. <laughs> Holy moly. We gotta do some uh, exercises together. To increase the hand muscle strength. But I don't think I can do much better than this. I think I have peaked. I think I have peaked. Stretch your hand by pulling it back towards your wrist. I think if I do that, I'm gonna break my hand on stream. Okay, bit of a slower beginning. Ah, and Riolo TM jumps into the barrier. What a loser. Wait, I wish I tried these bungles earlier, you know? I have clearly been held back by my input device. Okay. Now the drift. Okay, we popped it once again. Skirt! No, I pressed right in the left corner. What the fuck, Riolu? Idiot! <laughs> I just... I just pressed right for no reason. Hä? <laughs> <laughs> uh. Unbelievable. Hello, group. Thank you for the 100 bits. Am I winning? Uh, yes. I'm definitely the fastest bongo player right now. Ah, that's bad. Oh. Uh. Yeah, I'm just gonna keep going. Where are we? We're in a cave. Is there some Easter egg, maybe? Maybe a picture of me playing with the bongos? No. We dead. Would you advise me Donkey Kong or Diddy Kong bongos? I'm new to Trackmania. I don't know what to play with. Um, I think Donkey is better. The Donkey Kong bongo is better. You didn't know streamers have hands? Yeah, today your uh, entire view of the world burns and falls apart and falls into shatters. Dude, I'm actually 60th, yeah? I'm still Division 1. <laughs> like, what on earth is this? Is everyone driving slow on purpose? Unintended burn, by the way. 60 seconds. Oh shit. I need to improve again, but I don't think if I don't think I can. My run was pretty fast already. I have maybe reached my limits already, even though I am ahead. I did get the gear as well. Minus 006. Okay, we are on par with the PB. Can I? Ah, fuck! Ah, shit! My hands! My hands! My hands! <laughs> okay. Let's go again. I think I can improve. I think I have it in me. Because my end was not that good. I released in that one corner and you can take it full speed. That is where I do see potential. Ah, you gotta be kidding. No! Ah, oh, okay. Mm. 
Dude, if someone in the in-game chat is like, Yo, real, you're so slow, they don't know. But so far, everything seems calm. Fuck. Four minutes and 30 seconds left. Can I improve my time? We have dropped to 85th position. This is not very crunchy. Now I obviously have this strife and the motivation to become a Division 1 player and then get knocked out in second round. Fuck. 91st. You know, maybe it's better for me to get in a lower division so I have the, you know, potential to maybe survive for a few, one, <laughs> few rounds longer. Because consistency isn't really happening. Consistency with this? Red X emoji. You're crazy fast with bongos? Thanks, man. All my years of Trekmania and it has come down to this point. Okay, we're full speeding this. I have the PB pace. Go Riolu, in chat. Ooh, good end, good end, good end. Minus 28. I'm 50 <laughs> Ah, my hands. Oh my god, man. This is gonna be a butt clench, man. But I have some room for improvement. In the mid part, I can still go faster. But we are back in Div 1 for a brief moment until I get knocked out again. Oh, what a start! Holy ballsack, this is fast. Arms are heavy, palms are sweaty, mom spaghetti. I need a bit of a higher jump here, yes. Back-to-back -back PB? Oh shit. Oh, and he slides! What a loser! He gets the drift from the ice. I actually can't believe that I no-slid after the ice part. And what I too can't believe is that I'm just half a second behind the fastest time. Alright, ladies and gentlemen. 63rd position. <laughs> Sixty-fourth, we are on the hot seat with two minutes left. So that means I definitely have to improve again. Oh, this was good. Holy shit. I'm popping. What the fuck? What is this run? What is this run? What is this run? Please! No, I slid! No 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 no! Push, 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 push! 34th. I, th this is it, man. I think we actually made it into Division 1 now. <laughs> I had a bad end, though. I lost like two tenths in the ending. I could have had a 39.1 or something. <laughs> oh my god. Now I think we just have to go and uh, wait. I'm not gonna play anymore. I'm, I'm done. I'm fucking done with this. <laughs> I'm second on the server behind Otek. I beat Razzy and Speed Self and Rocky and Vichy and Infinity. Dude, I'm actually happy with this. Let's watch the GPS. This is not me driving. But yeah, I need to rest my, my hand. It's especially the right one. The left one is not really an issue. It's the right one. The right one is where all the, you know, I have to constantly press the, the gas. For those who don't know the uh, the input bindings. Uh, bongo, you know, two bongos. It's split into two halves. You can uh, see it, like there's a divider spot. Uh, I don't know if you can see the line. Camera is pretty shit, at least today. But there is a little divider. So the top half is right, the bottom half is gas. Then the top half on the left bongo is left, and the bottom half is uh, break. Exclamation mark bongo in the chat if you didn't understand. So... That's how I game. So I got 40th, ladies and gentlemen. Who... 
who said I'm gonna get 40th? Because <laughs> I said I'm gonna get 200th. <laughs> Alright. Three trophy fives. I think they should multiply this by 100. Because of my bongo. Hi Riolo, do you hold gear at CP1? I have no idea what I'm doing. I'm playing with bongos. I'm not listening to gears. <laughs> So Division 1, I think I'm going to die a miserable death in round 1 or in round 2. I don't think I'm going to survive <laughs> for very long, because I'm not very consistent with these. But holy moly, that was good. Thumbs up if you like this content. Look at this thumb. Do you like this thumb? Then press it. <laughs> Bonk. That's a good parking spot. This is probably free. Okay, we're joining. Congrats on ruining your controller muscle memory. Thanks. Holy moly. So we're on the server. I'm, I'm gonna rest my hands. Have you played with a steering wheel? I have, yes. I have and I... You're gonna try Summer Campaign too? Nah, Summer Campaign is not really relevant, I think, at this point. So, I'm gonna leave it at that. Needs more bashing and less pressing. Yeah, sadly, with the setup I have, I can't really bash. I wish I could, you know... I wish I could bash them harder, but I can't, because I constantly have to press at least one button, which is gas. So I can't really mash. I, c I could do this, but then uh, I'm not very precise. I'm trying my best to play good. Balo TM with 10 months of uh, Prime Gaming. Thank you very much. Also, Kramer with the second month of Prime. Almost forgot to shout you out. Thank you for the support. So, we're absolutely gaming. Wait, where am I? Am I Tarzan again? Tarzan in the bush. Or am I George W? Oh no. Thought I could get stuck somewhere, but no. Alright. We are gonna start in 30 seconds. Then we're gonna play the knockout. And in the knockout, the last four players always get eliminated per round. So it better won't be me. Because that would be sad. You are a crazy man. Thanks. Yeah, I'm very, I'm very pre pleasantly surprised. This was a good map for Bongos. I think if the map had more, I don't know, uh, direction changes, more quick, like quicker, faster direction changes, or more precision-based stuff, then this would have been a lot harder. Because precision is obviously pretty difficult, as you only have like two buttons. And you can't do the very quick taps. The quick taps is very hard. So in order to be precise, um, you need more luck than anything else, I think. Did you see my tweet? I saw. Good job, man. Very well done. So this is it, man. One round before we go live. And I think I'll just try to play it safe. And I can't wait for all the people to point fingers at me when I go out in the server. So we have the prediction here, the official cup of the day prediction by Plastic Fork, saying I'm gonna get 44th. I would be more than uh, satisfied with a 44th position. Okay, good luck. Have fun. Which division is this? This is division one. So, let's make the best out of it. I'm gonna get in my upright gamer position in the gaming chair, in the RGB gaming chair. And uh, let's see for how long I'm gonna survive. I'm excited and I'm scared. <laughs> I haven't felt this pressured in a long time. Because the entire bongo world is looking at me. Here we go, round one. 
The good thing, I can't retire by accident, because I don't have a retire button on my bongos. So, that is something. Okay, bit of a slower start here. But this is a very easy map, and not really a lot of people are gonna crash, so... <laughs> you have to be consistent, and you have to be fast. But I think I'm gonna make it into the next round. I think this looks good. 41st, not bad. I mean, I placed 1.2 seconds behind uh, the fastest player, who is Gwen. I think that's pretty good. Round 1, complete. White checkmark emoji. Ch -ch -ch. You can insert one here. Ch -ch -ch. White checkmark emoji. Very nice. As we see, Azion not making it. Yeah, it's unfortunate. I mean, that's, that's the game. Holy moly, dude. Alright. Round 2. I'm gonna quickly stop the steering on the transition from ramp to platform to minimize the amount of drift. Dude, this is good, man. This is gaming. I'm right behind Pingu. Not our Pingu, though, but some fake Pingu. Never mind, I'm not anymore. I think we're gonna survive another one here. 30th. We're popping. <laughs> oh my god. Not too terrible here. Maxi out. Ice TM out. Oh boy. Who else? Holo and Bernie. Alright, well, happens. Let's go. Next. Okay. I mean, I'm even getting the gear here, so that's fabulous. I gotta say, it's a good bongo track, because you barely have any inputs. Like, it's honestly not bad. Scoreboard is having a uh, spasm attack here. Okay, 30 seconds. Consistently, like, around, around one second behind. When will the Steel Series bongos drop? I don't know, man, but I uh, gotta contact my guys over at Steel Series. Maybe they're gonna release some bongos in the near future. Holunda Pingu, the fake Pingu is out. Next, and uh, I saw didn't see the last one. Okay, so Bongo is definitely the meta here in Trekmania 2020. Ah, not that good of a drift, had to release a lot. Oh, I touched. I have touched the barrier. But it looks like others have touched even harder. No idea how they did that, but... We cool. I only lost half a second. You guys are effing in the chat, man. What do you mean? F. More like G. For GG. <laughs> uh, Plastic Fork predicted 44th. So we're still in the game for the prediction. Okay, next. It's a bit easier to play rounds instead of time attack, because in time attack you barely have any breaks between your attempts. This is a bit easier on the hands in my opinion.
Okay. Definitely need a good ending here. Which I did get. Minimizing the drift, you get out of the ice and pop it into the finish. 3994. <laughs> uh, we good, we good, we good. We good. And I'm better than Shorts. Dude, next time I meet Shorts, I'm gonna rub that under his nose. Let's go. Did you qualify with the bongos? Yeah, man. Full bongo contents. Oh. Hoppala. Oh, that, that, that doesn't look good here. I have miscalculated the corner. This could be your opportunity to laugh. But I'm catching up. Maybe someone's gonna rip at the end. Oh no, 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 no. I don't wanna be out already. I'm so young. Oh. 42nd place. That was definitely an unnecessary mistake. I could have avoided that. Fuck. Ah, shit. Well, 40 seconds. I think this trophy is more than well deserved. <laughs> man, 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 man. I don't know what I was thinking. I turned way too early. Like, what the fuck did I do? Ay, ay, ay. All right. Well, 42nd place here for me in the cup of the day. Let's take a look at the remaining rounds. I think I still did great. We gotta do more of this. <laughs> not bad, not bad. I'm still happy. With my pace, you know, I was like consistently around one second behind. So with that pace, I probably could have placed around 30th or something, maybe a bit better, until my pace wasn't gonna be sufficient anymore. But yeah, not bad. Looks like we have a go again tomorrow. Nah, we, sh we shouldn't milk this, you know? You shouldn't milk this whole thing. If you do it too often, then it's also boring. But yeah, all of these players, they don't know what they're missing out on. They're all playing with freaking keyboard or gamepad or wheel. But they're missing out on this. Can't believe it. So we're currently taking a look at Speed Self, who I uh, in fact beat in the time attack, but he beat me in the knockout and now so many people are out. Letzta von Allen is actually not even Letzta because Amaterasu actually DNF'd. Darker DNF'd. Why does all of this shit always happen after I go out? Look at these people trolling in the round after I go out. Every single time. I can't believe it, man. Bongo TM goes out and everyone is like, Yeah, we're just gonna fucking troll. <laughs> Actually made it into match one with bongos. Yeah, I did. <laughs> I don't know how, but I, I did. Hello there. Nobody is perfect. You got Division 2 with controller a few days back and 40 seconds here. Proof that you should start maining bongos. True? Definitely, definitely. Ooh, a mistake here by Otek. He is falling behind and now we absolutely cannot see jack shit. Very nice. Someone falling out here. Losing grip. It, ooh, it's speed self. No way. Speed self is out. And it looks like we might be losing Frev. Oh no, Frev actually did catch up here. Kawi now on the hotspot. But he did pass uh, Razi, I think, who is going to drop down to the red position. And Razi is out together with Speed Self, Nustic, and Seven. Match Seven has server crash. Oh, really? God damn it. That sucks. What's the next challenge? Play with a DDR mat? Nah, nah, nah. That's too much uh, physical exercise. We don't do that. This is already enough, you know. My my hands, I'm gonna grow like a bicep on the on my on my thumb muscle. 
<laughs> Yo, crazy. Thanks, man. Going into the next round here. We are currently seeing Marius a little further behind. Nobody with a big bonk as far as I can see. His palms are going to get a six pack. Fuck yeah. Finally, everything I wanted. I'm sure Pingu is going to love this. We'll go on 28th. I heard that having good muscles here helps out to carry things. Dude, today we carried like a, a plate, like a piece of wood, a big piece of wood for the kitchen. It was like 45 kilogram or something. And you had to, you had to move it through a narrow, or we had to move it through a narrow uh, staircase. And holy moly, that was bad. That was so heavy. I wish I actually had these muscles in my hands. Oh, Sky Drew. That is a bit of lag. Not good. But yeah, that thing was heavy. Or not necessarily heavy. Oh, Kawi. Uh, not heavy, but it was just shit to handle. So we have almost died. But the Raid Shadow Legends sponsored kitchen is almost there. Have you heard of Raid Shadow Legends, by the way? <laughs> hmm. Incomplete kitchen, very nice. So yeah, sad story actually. Uh, so we ordered that oven. And then they said, yeah, we don't have the oven. So we ordered a full kitchen with oven, with everything, and then a couple days before it was meant to be sent out to our place, they were like, yeah, we don't have the oven, lol. <laughs> get fucked. <laughs> so we had to get a different oven from an external place. And uh, we wanted to have it delivered with express delivery, 24 hour express delivery. And you can imagine what happened. It wasn't 24 hour express delivery. It's still not there. It's not very express, if you ask me. Express more like we're actually slower than usual. Oh, Elcon, Ixon, Tricky, Skydrew, out, unbelievable. How much Fezant? 60 euro, yeah? We paid 60 euro for the shipping of the oven. It was 40 normal. 20 euro extra for the uh, freaking Dingsbums uh, express shipping and it wasn't express. That is very unfortunate. Oh, Energize. The player I spectated went out and another one. Apparently biting the dust here. Very bad. Haha, <laughs> short! Uh, schade. That's what we say here. Schade, schade. <laughs> when you went out, I was like, yo, I need to rub that under your nose. And uh, now I can do that. Gonna rub that under your nose. There. Rubbing it under your nose. Haha. -ha. So yeah, I'm playing the bongos. My Donkey Kong bongos. Made it. Made, made it much farther than I thought. So that's pretty good. Also, we have a brand new paid subscription coming from Taskalizer. Thank you very much for a brand new tier Uno subscription. I really appreciate it, man. That does help out. Enjoy the emotes, man. Very, very cool. But yeah, going into this round, we see Acid right now in the back together with Marius89, even though Marius is actually gaining one position here on Javzo. And it will be depending on the ending. Marius snapping out of the slide, gets a bit of an awkward bump. Luckily, no acceleration penalty for him. And he's still in. Acid and Javzo are out. DR6 is Dorian Raid? Yes. That is a Dorian Raid. Really looking forward to the kitchen tomorrow when they assemble it without the oven. 
It's gonna be really good. A kitchen is only good when it doesn't have an oven. Life hacks. Because an oven, you know, you don't need that anyway, right? Oh, we see Gwen being in the red for a short period of time, but he's back in. Barbos and Marios, two German players right now in the back, and Frev touches on the left. This is definitely the GG here. It looks like Barbos. Oh, he's gonna pass Super Karluf, and he actually gets it. Super Karluf gets eliminated. Barbos with the pass on the last straight. Wow. How do you set up the whole thing with the bongos? Um, so these bongos, they are originally meant for the GameCube, so it has a GameCube port. So you need a GameCube port to USB adapter, first of all. So you need bongos, you need the adapter, and you need drivers. Drivers that you use to basically translate the, game put, ga uh, the GameCube input into actual readable USB input. And then I use a tool called Joy2Key, which uh, allows you to map bindings to each of the specific uh, buttons here. Once again, two Germans in the back, Massa and Marius, both of them starting with an M. And uh, that is another abbreviation for out. Not sure if you knew, but uh, now you do. Massa is out on ninth place, Marius on uh, tenth. And the remaining players are still in the game here. Spam, still in. Gwen still in, I saw Kubai still in. Lots of good players. About the express shipping, if they actually took longer than what they said, get you 20 euro refunded. Yeah, I already called them. Told them uh, they suck. Now I told them uh, it didn't arrive and... Well, obviously I want to know when the oven arrives because uh, tomorrow the kitchen is going to be built and we don't have an oven. So that's, you know, not very convenient. Not very convenient whatsoever. But what's also inconvenient is the fact that Energize is finding himself on 8th place right now. Oh, Barbos with the hit on the left. He was trying to stabilize his car as he wiggled a bit too hard on the downhill. And therefore gets sent down to 8th place. Yeah, what Pingu said. Now we basically have to uh, wait for the oven and then we need to have it installed again by someone else, which is gonna cost extra money. Which means I need to play Raid Shadow Legends again. Very nice. Top 7. Matus, Gwen, Kobe, Otak, Spam, Energize and Kubais are still in the game. Let's take a look at Kubais. He is a very experienced player, was competitive a couple years ago. One of the best players we had in the tech style of Trackmania. And now he's doing pretty good as well in this round. He's finding himself in the battle for second place. Spam with a fantastic start right now. Otak a bit in the back, but still in the game as Otak attacks and actually passes Energize, who also bonks on the left and he's out. Going over the ice. Oh, Matus with the hit and he could actually get. Oh my god. What a clown fiesta. Give me the clown emoji in the chat, please. Matus actually choked it. He tried to no slide after the ice and then wasn't able to make it anymore. Rep, rip in pieces for Matus. And Energize remains in for another round. Incredible. Top 6. Let's take a look at Otak. Going for a Neo slide. He's rocking the Forza Uganda car skin. Good start for him. Good start for everyone, in fact. Nobody has made a mistake so far. Very, very close. Field, and now I called it. We have Kobe with the airtime at the top of the hill. And Kobe will definitely be out. Unless uh, someone pulls a, you know, bonk. That looks good, though. Everyone makes it. Gwen wins the round with a 38-80. In front of Spam, Otak, Kubais, Energize, and Kobe will get 6th in this cup of the day. Probably one of his best positions so far, so I think that's not too bad.
Top 5. Gwen versus Spam, you say, and Gwen wins. Okay. The bet by Racetal. Let's see what is going to be happening. Let's take a look at Gwen. He is uh, having a bit of a struggle here with the gear. Does not get the shift into fifth gear on the dirt. But immediately closes in. Good drifts here to the left. Maintains a lot of exit speed. Gwen pushing himself up to third place here. Good grip down the hill as well. Kubai is, is looking for a bathroom. No idea if he's going to find one here on the track, but Kubais is just standing on the track and he's out. Not good. Spam, Gwen, Otak and Energize. Two Grand League players against two non-Grand League players. And it is looking very good. Spam has been very dominant on this track. Gwen is Gwen. I think Energize and Otak are going to have a hard time fighting against these two players, but you never know. This track is very short, very punishing as well. One little mistake and you maybe can't catch up anymore. So let's take a look here at the next round. Spam with a very inside line. Also the player who started the drift uh, the earliest. So uh, a very good start here for the Dutch player. Energized with a good dirt section, passing Otak here up the hill. Gwen finding himself in second place pretty comfortably right now. The left-hander very tight, needs to be initiated with a Neo slide. And it is going to be between Energize and Otak. Energize with the same exit speed like Otak. It will be decided in the ending now. Who is going to get that ice section better? Who is going to maintain the drift better? Ooh, both with the same. And Energize with the Mario jump. Oh my god. He actually just bopped into the air. <laughs> and he's going to get elimination here. He did jump a bit too low and uh, clipped the edge. Therefore, he gets fourth, but still a good position considering that he was uh, on the edge of actually getting eliminated multiple times here in the cup. So, top three with Otak, Gwen, and Spam. Hey, Riol, you motivated me to try COTD for the first time. It was great fun. Nice, man. Keep going. These uh, competitions are always very, very fun to play, even with bongos. Anyway, going into the round, very, very good start for Spam and Gwen. Almost ideal, uh, identical lines through the dirt. Leaving Otak behind at the moment, and he needs a very, very good ending. He needs for a miracle to happen, because he is actually lacking some speed. Even though Gwen also lost a bit of speed, it will be decided in this section once again. This is very, very decisive. But Gwen manages to drift a lot better. As he cancelled the drift, he uh, stopped steering for a brief moment to get rid of the skid marks and to continue the turn without a drift. So it will be the final between Spam and Gwen. Very correctly called by Racetal. Let's see who is gonna win. Gwen versus Spam. I think Spam has some slightly better chances here. He looked much better on this track. And now he needs to prove himself on this track in the last round. Once again he's going for his line which as you can see is much better so right now he is finding himself in first place but Gwen with a good attack very nice and direct line on the dirt spam losing grip for a short period of time on the top of the hill Gwen shooting himself up to first place spam with a more wider approach here coming down to the left hander now this jump who's gonna get it better I think Gwen will have it in the pocket will Gwen win his 11th cup of the day it is looking good right now even though spam has a bit more speed is spam gonna make anything happen no it will not be enough 38.86 versus 38.921 by Spam. And that is the next victory for Gwen. Once again, he is not getting defeated. He delivers whenever he has to. And he wins in front of uh, Spam. GG. Very nice battle here in the end.